Ainaz kicks this on the inside this time in the dark red and grey colours of Latvia. His opponent Richard Pepper knows he can't afford to give uh, Kixis any ground. Length, but not too far. This is trying to take the battle higher up the track. Both 
riders casting shadows across the boards of the National Cycling Centre. Both drop down into the well of the track. Pace not sufficient to maintain forward momentum on the banking. Reynolds kicks this. Looks over his left shoulder now, looking down on Richard Pepper. Going as slow as he dare, bouncing that back wheel to reduce the pace even further. Reason being, of course, to try and force his opponent to come through and take up the lead position. Pepper resisting that as long as he can, but now he goes to the front, trying to steal a march, and Einar's kicks this. Well, I don't think that gap will be as big as Pepper would hope it would be. Kicks this responding quickly, and that is within a bike length of his opponent with a lap to go. No, uh, Kicks has got strength in depth. He's the holder of the World Masters' best time for the 200 metres. And the back straight they go. Pepper holding on well, though. Richard Pepper of Great Britain putting up a great fight here. Kicks is going to go around the outside because Pepper's inside that red sprinter's line. It's going to be really close to the line, but once again, Einar's Kicks is just eases out of the final corner and pushes his front wheel ahead. And in two straight lines, Einar's Kicks of Latvia progresses into the semi finals. Point zero four six, the uh, time for closing 200 metres. Minus Kixis acknowledging the applause of the crowd here in the uh, National Cycling Centre. Compliment sprint performance once again from Minus Kixis. We'll be hoping to maintain through the next two rounds on the way to, of course, the number of World Masters medal. Team number two features Marcel Laurens of Germany and Lee Staples of Great Britain. Reversal in the starting order from the first heat. So uh, this time it'll be the rounds of Germany who is on the outside. The obligation to follow these tables of Great Britain to leave this one away from the Yeah. 
one minute to go. The Japanese rider begins the acceleration. Four speed spins. Still maintained in favour of the defending champion. Now here comes Skorsky, glancing down the back straight. That's what works here, Ichimet has the shorter route to the line. on terms with his opponents. And here he comes. Well, this is a real charge here from Daniel Rickard of Australia. Can he come through on the line? Oh, that was agonizingly close, but I think he did. So that one will require a decision. That uh, deciding match coming up a little bit later, but our next order of business are our first victories.